these guys came out with a product that limits a gun to 10 rounds and it's fixed in the gun. It's fixed in the gun. Like you can't take the magazine out and it limits it to 10 rounds. That's like gun grabber utopia. That's like gun grabber um, paradise. That's almost Cuba. You know, it's like gun grabber paradise. It's, uh, you know, so if they're approaching Nirvana for their gun control with this item that limits the gun to 10 rounds and it defeats a 10 round uh, detachable magazine, like nothing could be better. But instead, they're again showing what their true intent is, and that is to bankrupt the gun industry and to make it so that nobody can buy a gun. That's really what they're after, even though they say, nobody's after your guns. You guys who cling to your guns and your religion, you know, you just got to chill out. And then fast forward 15 years, 16 years, they say, we need to change the, the view of gun ownership in America. Um, okay. Or the attitude around gun ownership. And then you say stuff like, Australia style gun control. Nah, you know what? We have something that Australia doesn't. It's called the Constitution. It's called the Bill of Rights. It's called the Second Amendment. And so you're not going to get it. You're not going to just come round up our guns. I'm sorry. That's not going to happen. Serbia. You don't mean AR 15. Serbia is doing that, by the way. And they don't have a Second Amendment either. You know who does, though? It's not called the Second Amendment, but they have constitutionally protected gun rights. Is the Czech Republic. Very good manufacturer of firearms, by the way. Uh, they make some great guns. And uh, they do have a protected right to keep and bear arms. So that's really good. We're going to talk a lot about that today, so you don't want to go anywhere. We're going to talk all about bearing arms.